Hey, is this thing on? I'm looking pretty good. Welcome, DigiDees, to the channel, and welcome to my first excuse of using the camera. That's right, I got myself a GoPro 10. The audio quality is acceptable, but the video quality is in 5.6K. It's amazing to expect a lot more content using this camera in general, a lot more maybe on real-life content. So, hey, I'd like to say maybe like and comment down below, but I'm probably about to say that in about 10 to 15 seconds anyway in the actual footage. So, thank you for checking out the channel. Thank you for giving an excuse to use this camera, and thank you, in general, for watching my content. Let's jump into it. Woo! Did that look cool? Probably not. I don't know. Still getting used to it. Welcome, DigiDees, to the official release, or rather, the early access version of Deep Rock the Galactic Survivor. That's right, Deep Rock has actually made a roguelike type of survival game where you kind of survive on different planets, have different unlockables, upgrades, and all the different sorts. We did visit this game once before on the channel, but it was in demo mode. A lot of stuff was still locked out, a lot of stuff was still in the process, a lot of things have still not been refined. So today, I know I shouldn't even be posting videos right now because I'm supposed to be working on the music video, but you know, with Survivor coming out, we also saw that, uh, what was it? Hell Risers, no, the, the Hell Divers 2 has been released as well. I might try to throw out a couple videos here and there while I work on the project in the background. But hey, so let's go ahead and take a look at what the Survivor kind of game has in store for us. What does the early access have? Now, I've not really taken a look at this at all. You can see I haven't got any experience, any challenges complete. I've got nothing going on. Now, first thing that I've realized right off the bat is the fact that we now have more characters. Before, these characters before us used to say, you know, not available in demo mode. Now, they simply say locked. That's right, sir. We start out with our scout, which has a max of HP 120, dodge chance, critical chance, critical damage. The scout usually more, more of a uh, squishy, versatile type of character. But we still have access to these other ones. Engineer, you know, have your drill, you have your gunner and all that sorts. So hopefully we can go ahead and try to see if we can unlock some of these, see what they have in store for us, see what we can do, and maybe we'll do more episodes on it in the future. But the only way I'm going to be able to know if you guys want more is if you comment down below that you want more or just simply like the video. You know, near the end of the video, just go ahead and leave a like or maybe during the middle of it. It really does help the algorithm and does help out my channel because I'm still very small. I'm still in like 9.5 thousand subscribers. It's next to basically nothing. So I appreciate every single bit that you guys can do to help get that video seen by that sweet little algorithm. Let's take a look. What have they improved since then? Does the game run smoother? You know, does it run faster? I mean, I can tell right off the bat, it is looking very beautiful. I gotta say, like, the graphics even on this model here off to the right-hand side looks very silky, very smooth, lots of good lighting see what's going on. Although, it's not very true to what the actual gameplay has to stay. But so why don't we go ahead and take a look at what the gameplay really is. So we have our classic mode, 10% move speed, plus 20% max speed, really straightforward rifle, shot rifle, boost some shoots and bursts, very classic, very bare bones is what we're starting off with, what you're going to be introduced with when you take a look at the game. So what do we have? Ooh, baby. All right, sounds good. I Right off the bat, I got to say the mining speed seems to be a lot faster in this mode, in, you know, in the early access. Comparatively before, it was, well, probably about half that speed. We seem to be mining a lot quicker, getting a lot more done immediately. The burst fire, kind of the auto fire of the, you know, genre of the game seems to be pretty on point. And again, immediately, I already feel like everything's just a little bit faster paced. It just took everything and ramped it up just by a little bit. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take 15% extra damage because we seem to be doing fine on fire rate. I'm going to just go ahead and take it. Oh, I forgot there is a reload mechanic to this game. So you can see your ammo down there in the very bottom with all of our different weapon choices. And those kind of fire off automatically. But now that we went through our last bulls, all that magazine is trying to reload. And now it can start firing. And it doesn't seem to pierce a few enemies. Very nice. So yeah, the music video has been progressing along pretty nicely. I mean, well, quote unquote, very nicely. Find the supply beacon. Oh, okay, in the very top left where our mini map is, I see a little beacon that is going off. I'm going to go ahead and assume that the supply bot is up over here. Level up, what do we have? I kind of want reload speed because it has taken quite a while to reload here. This is a supply beacon. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and kind of stand around here and see what happens. I might just have to be in the area. But yeah, the music video has been progressing somewhat decently fine. A lot of it's been me kind of figuring out how I want to set up shops, how I want to do things, you know, how to operate, well, how I want to get the scenes exactly how I want. I've changed a few things around all that. Basically put, I spent about three hours on Monday and I spent about four hours on Tuesday of basically just trying to figure out how to get everything to work. And I have about 12 seconds of footage. That's right. It takes that long to try to go ahead and get everything going. So we found a magnet, got a lot of XP here. Now we have plus 25% damage. I mean, or we could go XP game. I mean, XP game just means that we're gonna be leveling up faster overall, right? I mean, getting it early on seems like a nice choice. So let's, that's really hard to pass up though. 25% damage. I mean, the enemies are pretty weak at the moment. So let's take, we, let's take XP game. Oh, we got another level up, a new weapon. A grenade that deals moderate damage and slows enemies. 
Uh, we have a quick fire weapon that shoots in four directions or a close range shotgun. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I think the grenades would be better for just some AOE type of stuff going on here. Let's see. Yeah, immediately. It immediately just blew up a whole bunch of enemies with just that grenade. Yep. That cryo bomb is absolutely just decimating them. Ooh, and we have some detonators. Yeah, they have really, really spiked up, like, not the difficulty, but just the speed of this game. We seem to be getting right on into it. Another level up. Ah, uh, don't need a pickup radius. Whatever. You know, who cares about that? We'll take a fire rate. It's all right. Maybe I should have done a reroll, but as a first look into the game to see what it has to offer, I'm not exactly trying to, well, be a tryhard per se. I'm just trying to see what does it have to offer. I'm trying to see all the differences of what it used to be in the beta mode compared to what the early access mode is. But yeah, back to the topic of my me trying to always get off topic. I swear to God, I don't know how I managed to always do it, but I do. So the movie has been doing well. It has taken a long time to, not the movie, the music video has been taking a long time to try to get used to things in general and try to figure out what the direction I want to go with. But hey, I still have a couple or a few weeks to try to get this thing finished and out to you guys. In the meanwhile, if things start taking a little bit longer than I'd like, I, you know, I can still go ahead and try to put out this content, you know, sparingly every once in a while. Uh, let's go ahead and take a reload speed. Yeah, we need more reload speed in general. Um, but we can go ahead and try. Oh, okay. Okay. I need to be, I'm going to draw all these enemies away for a second. We need to be in that supply pod circle. It looks like it's ready to go here in a moment. The boss is starting to come in. I don't know if I've done a big enough circle. I've not done enough big enough circle at all. <laughs> at all. Yeah. I got to stand in here. Okay. Okay. Come on. A couple more seconds. A couple more seconds. Did I get it? Yes. Oh, baby. I got it. Um, increase your chance of a roll higher rarities. Damage bonus of a critical hit. I mean, I'm going to go ahead and do higher rarity. That seems kind of nice. Oh, baby. Look at all the XP. Get to the drop pod already. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Imagine your weapon is now a lot prettier. I don't increase weapon level to buy level by low increase weapon level by two. Oh, by two. Okay. I thought I was trying to say like increase the level, you know, to level two, but no, it's by two. Um, I do. I want to just go ahead and just high till right through all the enemies. Yeah. Get some of the XP. Why not? We take a little bit of damage, but I'm sure we'll find health around. Yeah. So it's been a very learning and, you know, kind of a very educational experience. I'm trying to figure out how to really how do you say just figure out the direction of like the cinematography of trying to get the music video correct you know what's going on in the background trying to get the green screen set up all this type of stuff so lots of new content is me coming along the way uh we really didn't get a lot of gold for any of this stuff did we we could have done a lot better but it seems to be again a lot more fast pace uh i'm not gonna re-roll i can't really afford anything here to begin with so i guess we'll just continue along into the next area god it would have been nice to get some of these but as a first look it's good to know see what kind of everything is different and oh it lands immediately onto some gold <laughs> i'll go ahead and take that why don't i draw out the elite yeah i'm gonna try to focus a little bit more on getting resource extraction here but yeah so i've also been trying to think of i was originally going to do a video essay on roguelikes which i think would be a little bit more on point to the channel since we do play a lot of roguelikes not necessarily to it's not the point of the channel, but it does seem to happen a lot because I don't know. I guess I just like the game, so I ended up playing a lot more about it. But you know, I, there's so many different topics I feel like I can make a video essay about. I mean, I, I kind of thought about like the current state of video games and why these smaller titles are doing so much better than these AAA titles. And the fact that Pal World has absolutely skyrocketed in popularity, did better than anything that Pokemon has ever done, and it's been like on the top charts of Steam and everyone is buying it everyone's playing it and now immediately hell divers too i'm getting a little bit cornered here i'm getting very cornered here um i'm gonna have to dig my way out of this one rock and stone brothers rock and stone dig my way out of this problem <laughs> oh god oh god um they're starting to come around i don't need to find a supply vegan i'm going to just go ahead and take this perimeter all the way around dig my way out of this situation Come on, leave me alone. <laughs> dig my way out. Dig my way out. We definitely need more weapons. I mean, hey, we don't have any upgrades yet to go into these worlds. I mean, this is a fresh account because it is early access. We've lost all of our progress, so everything's reset. So I don't have any extra upgrades to make this a little bit better. Okay, I need to get this quick. Get this quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Drop on down. Beautiful. Drop out all the XP uh, artifacts. You get a small chance to find XP when mining any kind of rock. Gain XP when you take damage. Oh, increase the healing granted on level up. I mean, I kind of want to get XP when I take damage. I mean, more XP in general is just always going to be a benefit to us because it's just going to be more leveling up and the more level, level up. The more we level up, the more, you know, goodies that we can get. Uh, another, yeah, speaking of it, another level up. Uh, I want more damage, I think, for the grenade in general because, yeah, that is my AoE. So if I can do more AoE damage, it's going to be nice. Yeah, so I, you know, do I want to do a video essay about about why Power World is doing so well, why Hell Divers is already beating Power World. They, they are already at the top of the Steam charts. Do I want to talk about the state of AAA games? Is it an overdone topic? I even thought about, not going to lie, I even thought about doing a topic on, I'm dead? <laughs> I want to do a topic on, I'm dead? 
<laughs> wow, mission failed. They did a lot of damage. I could have swore I had like 90 health there, and then they did a couple of hits, and I'm down. Wow, okay, that's that's a very quick um that was very quick. You know, hey, that is it. I I I I liked it. Did you guys like it? <laughs> you know, hey, well, let's take a look here. Now that we're at the main menu, we also have, look at all this. We have these upgrades, which we got for credits. We have 500 credits and also all these different resources that we're finding along the way. The, what is it? Jad is, we have Jad is, and we have, um, Chromium, and, uh, um, no, that maybe that's Jad is. I forget the name of all these <laughs> resources. Not gonna lie. But you do get upgrades along the way. You can build up your character so we can do better mining speed, move speed, XP gain, pickup radius. Honestly, I'm just gonna do XP gain in general. That is just a base format that is always gonna be helpful. And 2%, it's, it's pretty generic, pretty generic, but you know, that's gonna be nice because we upgrade that. My God, how many levels do I have? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. There are 12 levels to each of these upgrades. So by 2%, that's me an extra 24% XP gain at the start of every single like run if you were to get this up all the way. On top of armor, max health, critical chances, critical damage, life life regeneration. Oh, maybe I should have gone for that. Hello, life regeneration. Now that's probably spot on. That's gonna be really good. Pickup radius, luck, mining speed, reload speed, damage in general. Yeah, now all that great stuff. Yeah, take a look at I gotta say, early access first look initially right here at Deep Rock Galactic Survivor Danger Darkness Doors. Rock and stone, my brother. I I like it. I honestly wanna play more of this. And do you guys wanna see more episodes? Since this was a Pretty short episode in general is probably only going to be like, what, nine, ten minutes? It is what it is. You know, I'm kind of making a quick episode in between with me making content just because, again, I'm working on different projects. I've talked enough about that. Leave your comments down below and what you guys are excited most to see about and more about the game. So, yeah, thank you, DigiDs, for watching the video. I'm still not really sure how to do any of these outros, but if there is one thing that I can and always will guarantee you, so I'll be able to see you guys in the next video. Thank you and bye-bye.